So I'm standing here, obviously, in the footsteps of the Statue of Liberty. And if you look just off there in the distance, you see downtown uh, New York City and Wall Street there. You see Freedom Tower rising up there in the left and Wall Street there in the distance, you know. One of the basic themes that I'm operating under is that what occurred in Wall Street is going to destroy this country, that the financial uh, system that exists in our country and uh, by extension our legal, political, government, economic and social systems are in desperate straits right now. And they are in desperate straits because the people that operate in that little square of dirt there in New York City and in financial institutions all across this country and frankly around the world fail to heed basic principles of fairness and equality. And that our government, a few hundred miles south of here, primarily in Washington, D.C., failed to protect the people. If you look around all of us, you see that, you know, the primary responsibility and arguably the only responsibility of government is to protect people. Now, my th operating theme, of course, is that the government failed to protect people from those people operating in downtown New York City and financial institutions all around. But the most important thing I want to talk about is the Statue of Liberty right there and attorneys. It was a call to action to attorneys practicing all across this country especially. To look at that oath of admission you took when you became an attorney. You took an oath to protect and defend the Constitution of the United States of America. And the fact of the matter is that as an attorney, as you sit aside and watch the Constitution be trampled, as you watch the rights of Americans be desecrated every single day, as you watch things like the National Defense Authorization Act of 2012, which was just signed into law on December 31st, 2011 by President Obama, you're not doing your job and you're not fulfilling your most important obligation, and that is to protect and defend the Constitution of the United States of America. The fact of the matter is that uh, Bill of Rights and the Constitution are being trashed every single day. Attorneys, activists, common citizens are being stamped out for attempting to uh, exercise their rights under the First Amendment. Our rights to be safe and secure under our homes are being trashed as banks and institutions kick down doors, seize people's property, and law enforcement and courts aren't doing anything about that. Our rights to due process are likewise being trampled because as we're allowing the banks and institutions and Wall Street just around the corner to kick down doors, to seize people's property, to change locks and get away with all that they're doing, our due process rights are being desecrated. So especially you attorneys out there who took an oath to protect and defend the Constitution of the United States of America, and you took an oath to stand up for the rights of citizens, those people all around us here. If you're not waking up every single day reading the Constitution, paying attention to the Bill of Rights, and fulfilling your basic roles and responsibilities as an attorney, Attorney, you shouldn't be practicing anymore. So for everyone out there, especially you attorneys, grab the Constitution, grab the Bill of Rights, read them every morning, and understand that your responsibility, that sacred oath you took, is to protect and defend not the corporate masters that you serve, but liberty and the Constitution of the United States of America. Keep that in mind and think about that every day as you set off to work.